Peace, everyone. Welcome to another episode of JL Jupiter TV. And in this episode, we're going to hit up the Reading Terminal Market to try out Tommy Denick's roast pork, roast beef sandwiches. Every time I come here, there's always a line. It's always busy. So we're about to check this place out, see if it's good or not. It looks really good, honestly. But let's get into the video, y'all. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Let's get it going. Alright y'all, we back here at the Reading Terminal Market, Philadelphia, right next to Chinatown. Um, you know what, like every time I've come here, it was mainly on the weekends, so I never actually got a chance to really hit up um, the next roast pork or roast beef. I think they specialize in their roast pork. I got both. I got, I got the roast pork and I got the roast beef, uh, one with sweet onions, the other one with hot. Comes out super fast, once you order it. It's pretty much there in like 30 seconds. So I'm here on a Tuesday, no lines whatsoever, but on the weekends, forget about it. You're gonna have a line wrapped around the corner. We're gonna do the roast beef first. Let's check out the roast beef, all right? All right, ooh, that looks beautiful. That's a beautiful sandwich right there. Oh, that is a beautiful looking sandwich. We got the nice seeded rolls. I think this is with the hot peppers. Let's put it right up to the camera. Ooh, look at the love. Y'all see the love? Y'all see the love? Let's check it out, baby. I'm about to open this baby up. Uh, woo -hoo 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 <laughs> that is a beautiful looking sandwich. Would you would you guys consider this a tourist trap? I mean, I don't know. I'm not I'm not too sure, but it looks very promising. Um, I love the prep. You better not give me no ticket, PPA. But it looks very promising. This looks really good. They put the extra gravy on top too, but let's get right into it. Uh, see the details again? This is with the spinach. So I got roast beef, spinach, and I think this may be hot or sweet peppers with some sharp provolone. All right, let's get into it. Mmm. 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 That is fantastic. I mean, I don't know if coming on a Tuesday actually helps with the quality or not, but when I first bit into that, the spinach had a nice crispiness to it. Cheese, beef is really tender. I don't even know what type of pepper this is. Sweet peppers. It's fantastic. On a Tuesday, weekdays. I can't speak about the weekends, you know, but this is actually really good. There's a nice saltiness to it. It's not bland. It's really delicious. Cheese is on the bottom. Well done, guys. I was kind of wary of doing this place because it's in a a touristy area but I guess this video is mainly for people that want to visit Philadelphia right the Reading Terminal Market is one of the places you have to visit it's a lot of a lot of good eats over there this is one of them I'm gonna definitely come back hit up a few more if you guys um want me to visit a specific place in here at the Reading Terminal Market please let me know drop a comment 
But the next is definitely the roast beef itself, fire. Mm. The bread love, let's talk about the bread. Perfect for this type of sandwich. When he added that extra layer of gravy on top, I thought it was gonna make it soggy. But I guess the roast beef and that bread soaked it up just right. And I love like the kind of like, the way they do their spinach. There's a nice bitterness and crispiness to it. There's actually two locations that I know of. One of them is at the Reading Terminal Market and the other one is in Jersey, which is right off the Black Horse Pike. So, I don't know if location matters in this uh, in this instance right here, but the one at Reading Terminal Market, if you're able to get it, definitely, definitely a great sandwich. Very well done. What the heck is going on with the PPA? They standing right next to me. So that was for my beef eaters. Let's move on to the pork, the roast pork. I heard this is the one. I heard this is what they known for. I eat pork by everything in moderation for me. So let's get into it. Yo, what's going on over here? Let's do the reveal. Double wrapped. It's really beautiful. Again, presentation is everything. Sandwich looks phenomenal. It looks like it's gonna be a great sandwich. This is the other side, this is the seated part. Open this baby up, boom. Roast pork. I'm assuming that, oh, okay. So this is the roast pork with the broccoli rob and the hot peppers and some sharp provolone as well. You guys see that? You focus in. I'm gonna have to give that a game changer right there. I mean, the roast beef was great. But the roast pork and the broccoli rob and the hot peppers, that is a classic. This is excellent. Like, hold on. Mm. Mm. Pepper is not hot. The broccoli rob is done right. Y'all see that? Their spinach and their broccoli rob done right. Nice, crispy, crunchy, a good, nice bitterness to it. You add it along with the uh, hot pepper and the roast pork and that bread. Let's look at the bread, love. This has been sitting for maybe a good 10 to 15 minutes after I got it, but it still holds its weight. The juice is soaked up at the bottom, but it's not soggy. Hmm. That's fantastic. This, the hype is real on this one. Actually, now that I think about it, the roast pork, I mean, the roast beef itself could be like this as well if you added on the broccoli rob and the hot peppers. So each sandwich is like, I'm not mad. It's like, it's, it's really, really good. They probably do it with all their sandwich, but make sure they put extra, extra gravy on top. If you come on a weekday, Tuesday, there's no line, you get it right away. I definitely recommend them. This is a really, really good sandwich. Like the roast beef and the roast pork, Philly knows how to do that as well. Actually, Philly, South Jersey, the whole tri-state, they just know how to do that. The cheesesteak is the national sandwich here, but when it comes to the actual roast beef and roast pork itself, excellent, excellent. That's a good alternative sandwich. If you guys don't want to eat cheesesteak, the roast beef and the roast pork. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the, um, you know, the review on uh, Danick's roast pork, roast beef over here at Reading Terminal. If you guys can get here, if you guys coming from out of town, this is actually a great place to stop just cause, you know, you're right downtown, right center cities, right here. You guys would definitely love this. There's some other spots in there too that you should check out. I'm, I'm gonna get to it on another day cause I'm like kind of full right now. 
But definitely, y'all, thank you for joining me. If there's, like I said, if there's other spots in there you want me to check out in uh, the Reading Terminal Market, leave a comment or any place near here. And I will see you on the next episode. Thank you for rocking with me. Make sure you subscribe, like, comment, and share. I'll see you guys on the next episode, y'all. Peace.